When I arrived, there was a lot of scepticism about innovation, about engaging with commercial companies. Yes, we had outstanding science, and of course, that's what we do, but it only goes so far to actually delivering societal benefit. I think through the diversification of the campus, we have had increasing engagement with pharmaceutical companies, with biotech companies, with other technology companies. They've managed to engage our scientists on science, and that's developed a broader respect and a broader appreciation of what it takes to deliver patient benefit from Sanger Science. The vision behind BIC was quite simple. Um, we are seeing more and more companies develop from the Sanger Institute from EBI, um, and we need to give them a home. We need to put them somewhere where they have the right resources, the right facilities to be able to work with genomic and biodata. But also it's about opening the gates of the campus so that companies can come and join us here and work collaboratively. We think by creating a critical mass of companies engaged in research around genomics and biodata that we can really improve healthcare outcomes. Congenica is a genome digital health uh, company that is simplifying all the great genomic research that's been developed over the last 20 years here on campus and applying it in the clinic to make diagnoses for patients with inherited genetic disease. I was really keen to set our company up on the genome campus because of people. 2,000 uh, individuals who are focused exclusively on genomics and importantly on data analysis, which is really beneficial for a company like ours. For us coming to the Welcome Genome Campus was a no-brainer. So uh, Eagle Genomics you know, moved here about four months ago and uh, even when we go abroad, uh, in particular in the US, uh, mentioning the work on the Genome Campus uh, is you know, brings a bit of cachet uh, because everybody knows the Genome Campus, the Sanger and the EBI. Uh, and for us it was a bit like coming back home. Uh, I used to work on this campus and some of my staff as well. Uh, so we are reconnecting with the community here and uh, a lot of collaborations are already kind of uh, starting uh, just because of that. The question might come up, uh, why be here? Why not just access all the information including the genomes online? And most of the genomes are hosted online. And what I've found in practice here already, and it's only been a few months that our company has been here, is that the in-person interactions that have been initiated have been extraordinary. And from that flows not only research partnerships, but discussions of what we could do together next. Could never do that online. This is a very strong statement to the outside world, that the campus and the organizations that are already here want to embrace the possibilities that translation through commercial activity can bring. And so with the Biodata Innovation Center, which is now approximately 50% full, we are encouraging companies, but companies that are working on that core theme of genomes and biodata, to consider whether they would like to come to the campus. And in coming to the campus, absorb the science of the campus, engage in the activities around the campus, and essentially utilize that collective intellect of the two to two and a half thousand people to here.